Hey y'all, and y'all already know, like I told y'all before, welcome back to another hair video. Cue the intro. And support a black owned business. I run my city from the west side, big to best, I do a die to shite. Wayne Louisiana, Dr. Dre, the Los Angeles, this is it, bitch, Michael Misfit. Huh, day a legend and moonwalk, sliding across the stage in 87. This that Tupac out the window, both hands throwing up that middle finger. Fuck them other niggas, ratchet bitches in my demons, yeah, I'm queening. All right, so if y'all hear something going, ha, oh, that's the motherfucking air conditioner. I can't. I had the door shut earlier, as you can see, because I ain't want that all behind me, but fuck that. I'm not finna melt in this motherfucker. I already look like a candle by the fucking arms. I'm not willing to lose none of this melanin, okay? So anyway, you heard what I said. It's another hair video. Why? Because y'all asked and y'all gonna receive. I may as well say this now and y'all gonna hear it on another video. Y'all been asking me to put my seatbelt on in these videos. The only reason I'm gonna oblige that shit, bitch, because I rewatched one of my videos while I was in the car. The most annoying thing in the video was that beep, 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 bitch, put the seatbelt on. Okay? I get it now. All right, I understand y'all doing it for safety reasons, as I should. I'm going to get there one day. He's still working on me, okay? But I'm going to oblige you motherfuckers with the seatbelt because I had no idea how annoying that shit sounded, especially if your TV be loud, okay? I had to go off on that tangent because it really pissed me off. We're going to get back into the hair. So y'all already know what I done did. I went on Amazon and I got some of their Le Sheep wigs, uh, some nails. I got some of the Le Sheep wigs, okay, and I'm bringing them to, Lord, I done got a wig with fucking color. I forgot all about it. Okay. Okay, so, for those of y'all that are new, welcome. Sorry, I done got into the bullshit first. Done scared y'all off, but if you still here, welcome, huh? Welcome or welcome back. If this ain't your first time here, have you subscribed already? Because that's some shit that you should have been did. I think I'm going to make like a little pilot thing. Hello and welcome to Love Airlines. Before proceeding to the flight or to the video, we're going to have you follow some rules. If you are sitting near the exit and that is because you do not like cursing and or frequent pauses, not for this video, but different videos, if you're seeing this message, go ahead and pull the latch and exit now. Ah, 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 ah. Bitch, I'm crazy. But anyway, what came in this bag? Okay, we got... Bitch. Bitch. We gonna find out how much this wig was because I'm gonna put it right here. For whatever it costs, bitch, they sent whole hoops. They sent ho... I'm already so. I don't give a fuck what the wig look like. Baby, I ain't never lied to y'all before until now. They sent whole hoops. This is a goddamn gift, okay? Now they sent the net, my small gift, my deep. Oh, they even, they wrote a hand note. What kind of romantic motherfuckers is these? They wrote a hand note with a flower on it. That's sexy than a bitch, the fuck? I'm so fuck it, video over. No, I'm just playing. Ha! <laughs> bitch, they sent whole hoops. I feel like they should be on. I feel like they sent the whole hoops because them whole hoops go with this wig. So regardless to however the fuck the wig looks, y'all send me some whole hoops. So they know them bitch, these whole hoops is heavy. So y'all know who y'all catering to, right? Y'all know who y'all selling the wigs to. Bitch. And then they send go. You know places usually send shit in silver, bitch. Everybody do not wear silver. Most motherfuckers wear gold. But anyway, I am so pleased. They sent heavy ho hoops, bitch. I don't know what to do with my motherfucking self other than go ahead on and put this wig on. So, I'm um, sorry. As I was saying in the introduction, this is She Gotta Go Wear Her To The Stone. Now, usually, I have a series of wigs, but I decided I want to see if I can make her go to the stove wearable if she not. Okay? So, that's what we doing here. Now, uh, I got all the gifts out, I think, because these are some sexy motherfucking people. I feel like it's more shit in this bag. Hold on. Because who? Bitch. Bitch, they sent tattoos. 
Bitch, they said tattoo. I'm sold on the gift alone. Cause who don't like a good rub on tattoo? But we, I feel this wig. I saw the color and I don't know why I did it. But bitch, I wore a blue wig before. Let's get into it. Okay. Oh, they even sent a hair tie. Well, too bad I don't have no hair for that. Uh, They don't know. They didn't know. Okay, so this was a curly ombre wig I got. And, okay. Okay, y'all did so well. Y'all did so well with the gifts. Um, but the gift, the gift has got to be the wig construction. Uh, this, this is what I was talking about in the Cheetahs video. Stop doing this. Stop doing this. Stop, stop doing this. Stop doing this. Stop doing this. Okay? If you got to put motherfucking tire grout in the middle of these wigs for parts, just don't do no part. Huh? Put a bang in it. The, there's no, there's no reason the part is the same color as the wig. Okay? Don't nobody believe that. Don't nobody believe that. Okay? The, I don't, my scalp is not black nowhere. Okay, I don't have black scalp. Don't nobody believe that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Or send concealer. You could have kept the tattoos. Love the whole hoops. Send some concealer. You know what I mean? So, let's discuss the construction. Uh, we got the bra straps. We got the net mesh cap in the back. We got the two cones on the side. Okay, so we got all that done. Let me... Let me hook the wig together. It's curly, uh, so whew, hopefully there's not too much that needs to be done. But uh, you know how that should go. So, okay, I got the hooks on. I got the hooks on. Uh, I, okay, so uh, it looked like baby doll hair. Like, on camera, it may not translate as such, and I'm glad. But, like, outside, I'm scared because I do not want it to look like baby doll hair. And then this, I don't want this to happen. You paid $7 or something for it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Let's get it on. Wait. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Okay, cue what the wig look like on Amazon. I think it's a curly bob wig because I can see the bob. Uh, hmm. But I guess it's an asymmetrical because this side is definitely longer. Let me make sure the part is in the middle. It's in the middle enough. Oh my. Okay, it's hot up under this wig. Uh, all right, so first of all, I feel like I sell single cigarettes. Uh, definitely feel like the bitch that let you know that her nigga wash cars. Okay. Um, <sighs> okay. Right now she got to go. A, because she's a curly unit. It ain't too much I can do to her. But I mean, I can do something. I'm going to try. I'm going to try and do something to her because... Who the, who the fuck thought this up? Who thought this up? Who thought this was a good idea? Who do y'all got cutting the wigs into Bob? Stevie fucking Wonder? Who who thought this was all right? And then for some reason, my forehead is foreheading. Like, where did I get all this additional fucking dome from? Why does it make my forehead look so extendocito, cuz? Why does my forehead look like this? I am not pleased. Okay. Okay, it's that hot because I got the door open. I feel like this is a bad Diana Ross experience and I'm slick fucking over it. Uh, but 
you know what we came to do. So I'm gonna try and do it. Cue voiceover. Okay, bitch, so I can't get this wig too much just because the color was not bad looking. And on camera, the curls translate very motherfucking well, okay? It did feel like baby doll hair. It did feel like I had a leather jacket across the top of my motherfucking head because they literally compiled so much hair into this goddamn wig attempting to make it look natural, okay? I don't know why they put all the hair in the bottom and around the motherfucking wig and not at the top to give you that flat ass laid down look. That shit do not look real, okay? Now, these scissors are by far, again, the dullest scissors in the goddamn house, all right? And I think I went and got another pair. Bitch, I'm over it. All fucking ready because, like I told y'all, the AC is on and I am literally smoldering under this goddamn wig. Now, my primary concern while I'm doing all this cutting, etching, and sketching, trying to make this wig look like something that's appealing to me, because a lot of y'all will be like, oh, girl, ain't nothing wrong with that wig, bitch, you wear it. You try wearing a motherfucking latex ball cap full of hair on top of your motherfucking head, then come talk to me. Okay, so certain size look good. Like right there, I, I could deal with that as long as she has some height up in the middle. I could deal with that. You know what I'm saying? That that middle part was giving me pause, baby. I ain't never had that much forehead. I feel like it gave additional forehead. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I got a pretty big motherfucker up there. Okay, that, that whole whole thoughts. That whole do whole thoughts. But I don't ever want you to look at me and be like, God damn, she got a bunch of hair. Sometimes it be the motherfucking hairstyle you got on. And I do not like middle parted, colorful, curly fucking wigs because I do not want to look like Johnny Depp on Alice in Wonderland. I just really do not when he was the Mad Hatter Q picture. Okay, so I'm trying my damnness to attempt to put some lift in the top of this wig by lifting up the middle and the bottom by trying to cut these layers in it child i'm trying to give you all that i got and i just i i have nothing with houston voice i have absolutely nothing because the, the the top of this wig like i said it's it's really giving me smoker holiday i got the bike like that's that's what i'm getting from the top of this wig baby i tried i tried my best to do all of what I could do with this motherfucking cashmere sweater attached to the top of my head, bitch. And cutting and cutting until eventually, you know what I'm saying? I figured, okay, maybe if I add some mousse to it, maybe if I put a little mousse on it, you know, that'll fix it. That'll give it a little bit of volume or give it, a, you know, it, it would give it something for fuck's sakes. Because I wasn't able to give it a goddamn thing. Okay. I done did to it all I'm gonna do. Okay. Some of y'all may say, Natalie, you can finish freaking that wig out, baby. It is so much bulk up under here. In this motherfucking wig, I am profusely sweating. The wig is sliding the fuck off. Even with the combs in my head. Okay. It felt like I got a cashmere sweater on out this bitch there this this part is what's giving this is what's giving me pause this is the problem okay all of this i could have probably did some with is this it's giving me smoker i can't do it okay i'm not gonna stand here on these bad ankles and attempt to give no more to this wig when this is the problem okay that's that's the problem okay even Hold on. See, it just, it's just, it's a wig wig. It's a wig wig, okay? It's a wig 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 wig. Because normally the, the comb over, the pullover normally work for everything, okay? And it don't look half bad on this wig in all honesty. That color is actually cute as the fuck, okay? But let me show you the shit that you don't be paying attention to. This. This what you don't, this you can't fix. You can't fix that. So it'll be cool for a little picture. Okay, you get the point? It'll be cool for a little picture. But as far as wearing her to the store, I will not. I will not, I cannot, I shall not, I shallant. Uh, no, she got to stay at the house. Baby got to stay at the house. It's way too much hot ass synthetic hair and girth. 
on, on the bike and bottom of this wig. There's no reason. I am profusely sweating and you can't see it right now. I'm sweating all up in and through here. Okay, this wig hot. This wig is hot. I live in Las Vegas. This ain't a Las Vegas wig. This wig is hot. Y'all shouldn't even mail this wig to Las Vegas. All right? Okay, y'all got that. Y'all got it. I don't I don't like that one. I don't I don't even know where to throw it to be nice. I don't like that one. She got to go. I can't wear her to the store. I can't fix her now. She cool for a cute little photo op. Absolutely. Other than that, absolutely the fuck not. Okay, I'm not happy. I am pleased with the whole hoops. And I see why all the gifts were so nice. And y'all gave me a handwritten fucking note. So, I mean, but the, the weight on that goddamn wig, the amount of heat... Coming from the, I instantly have cooled the fuck off with that wig off. Now my nose tell a different lie, but I've instantly cooled off with that wig off. All right, y'all already know how this finna go, huh? I got hair all over my face. I hate to have hair all over my person. We on to the next one. Y'all already know how this thing going. Till next time. Mm -hmm. Bye.